The only time when a woman is completely and utterly helpless is when her nail polish is drying. And when it does, she'll touch everything like this. <laughs> and when it does, she'll touch everything like this. <laughs> it's so awkward to do. One of the worst things that can happen to you is ruining a fresh manicure. It's, it's, one, it, it's one of the worst things. It's just so upsetting. I'm sorry, can we stop? If you ruin a fresh manicure, even while your nails are still wet, immediately fill in the gaps. Then you can blend it in with bio oil if you don't have time to redo. The little thing you use to push your cuticles back, that will scrape off excess nail polish when wet. And those little cotton buds you use to clean your ears, dipped in nail polish remover, they become a secret weapon. Before you start a fresh mani, make sure all excess nail polish is taken off or else you'll get bumps. You can use wipes, nail polish remover and cotton wool or this amazing awkward contraption I use. Gross. Another good option, if you don't have time to get your nails done at a salon, are the wonderful at-home gel nail sets. Sally Hansen make a wonderful one, Sensational have another very professional set, and Fuse Nails have you sorted with a USB on-the-go nail set. It doesn't take long for you to have a full set of finished gel nails while answering emails. Don't bite your nails. It's ugly and unhygienic, and you won't be able to stop. You'll end up in your late 20s in your beauty studio with all these stubs just obsessing over nails. Don't do it. Ah. <laughs> Don't end up like me. Take care of your nails.